Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x plus 3 bracket power of 6 is equal to 2 power of 6, to find the values of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll take this 2 power of 6 into the left side. So, it will be this, which is x plus 3 bracket power of 6. We'll take this 2 power of 6 into this side to be minus 2 power of 6 is equal to 0. Then this x plus 3 bracket power of 6 we make into square. So it will be x plus 3 bracket power of 3, then bracket again square, minus 2 power of 6 into square, it is 2 power of 3 bracket square. Then it is equal to 0. Now from here is now in the form of difference of 2 squares. So we'll apply a difference of 2 squares rule, which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. So when you compare a square with 2x plus 3 bracket power, power of 3 bracket square, then a is equal to this here, which is x plus 3 bracket power of 3. And when you compare here minus minus when you compare b square with 2 power of 3 bracket square then b is equal to this here which is 2 power of 3 then from here in the left side we'll apply this form here of a plus b it will be this plus this so x plus 3 bracket power of 3 plus 2 power of 3 then bracket then bracket a minus b it will be this minus this so x plus 3 bracket power of 3 minus 2 power of 3 bracket is equal to 0 then in the next step from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution which is x plus 3 bracket power of 3 plus 2 power of 3 is equal to 0 and we have this solution here of x plus 3 bracket power 3 minus 2 power 3 is equal to 0. Then from this solution here, from this left side, is in the form of a power of 3 plus b power 3, which is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket then we'll apply this form a plus b it will be this inside the bracket plus 2 so x plus 3 plus 2 so here x plus 3 plus 2 bracket then bracket a square it will be this x plus 3 bracket square so x plus 3 bracket square then minus a b it will be x plus 3 times 2 so which is same as 2 bracket x plus 3 bracket then plus b square it will be 2 square which is 4 is equal to 0 then in the next step it will be x 3 plus 2 it is 5 so it will be x plus 5 bracket bracket Works x plus 3 bracket square this here is same as x times x is x square plus x plus 2 times x times 3 it is 6x plus 3 square it is 9 then we open the bracket here by this negative 2 so it will be negative 2 times x is negative 2x negative 2 times 3 is negative 6 then plus 4 bracket is equal to 0. Then it will be x plus 5 bracket bracket x square. Then 6x minus 2x is 4x. So it will be plus 4x. 9 minus 6 is 3. 3 plus 4 is 7. So it will be plus 7 bracket is equal to 0. 
then in the next step from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution x plus 5 is equal to 0 and we have this solution here x square plus 4x plus 7 is equal to 0 then from here we we'll take 5 to this side will be x is equal to negative 5 so this is the first solution for the value of x and to solve from this quadratic equation we'll solve by using quadratic formula so from quadratic formula which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a whereas a is equal to coefficient of x squared it is 1 b is equal to coefficient of x is 4 and c is equal to constant which is 7 then it will be x is equal to negative b b is 4 so it will be negative 4 plus or minus square root of b square it will be 4 square which is 16 minus 4 times a 1 times c is 7 then over 2 times a which is 1 then it will be x is equal to negative 4 plus or minus square root of 16 minus 4 times 7 is minus 28 then over this and this is 2 then it will be x is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of 16 minus 28 it is minus 12 then over this 2 then it will be x is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of minus 12 is same as square root of 4 times 3 times negative 1 then over this 2 so it will be x is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of 4 it is 2 square root of negative 1 it is i then times this square root of 3 then over 2 it can be divided in this part and this part so here divide by 2 and here divide by 2 so it will be x is equal to negative 4 divided by 2 it is negative 2 plus or minus and to here this 2 cancel this 2 so it will be i square root of 3 so i square root of 3 so from here this second solution we have two solutions of complex solutions because of plus or minus now let's solve from the second solution into this second solution here is in the form of a power of 3 minus b power of 3 which is equal to a minus b bracket bracket a square plus a b plus b square bracket then we'll apply this form here from here in the left side so a minus b it will be x plus 3 minus 2 so x plus 3 minus 2 bracket bracket a square it will be this square so x plus 3 bracket square then plus a b it will be x plus 3 times 2 which is same as 2 bracket x plus 3 bracket then plus b square it will be 2 square which is 4 bracket is equal to this 0 then it will be x 3 minus 2 it is 1 so it will be x plus 1 bracket bracket x plus 3 bracket square we expand this it will be x times x here it will be x square then plus 2 times x times 3 is 6 x plus 3 square it is 9 then plus 2 times x it is 2 x plus 2 times 3 it is 6 then plus 4 bracket is equal to this 0 then to be x plus 1 bracket bracket x square 6x plus 2x is 8x so it will be plus 8x plus 9 plus 6 is 15 plus 4 15 plus 4 it is 19 so here it will be plus 19 bracket is equal to 0 
then from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution x plus 1 is equal to 0 and we have this solution x square plus 8x plus 19 is equal to 0 then from this solution we take 1 to this side so it will be x is equal to negative 1 so here we have the other solution which is real solution then to solve from this quadratic equation we will solve by using quadratic formula from quadratic formula which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a so it will be x is equal to negative b b is coefficient of x which is 8 then plus or minus square root of b square it will be 8 square then minus 4 times a coefficient of x square which is 1 times c which is constant it is 19 then over 2 times a is 1 then it will be x is equal to negative 8 plus or minus square root of 8 square it is 64 minus 4 times 19 it is minus 4 times 9 is 36 go 3 4 times 1 is 4 plus 3 is 7 then over this and this is 2 then it will be x is equal to negative 8 plus or minus square root of 64 minus 76 6 it will be negative 6 minus 4 it is 2 7 minus 6 is 1 then over this 2 then it will be x is equal to negative 8 plus or minus square root of 12 is same as square root of 4 times 3 times negative 1 then over this 2 then it will be x is equal to negative 8 plus or minus square root of 4 it is 2 square root of negative 1 it is i then times this square root of 3 then we divide by 2 divide by 2 it can be divided in this part and this part so over 2 and here over 2 so it will be x is equal to negative 8 divided by 2 is negative 4 plus or minus this 2 and this 2 will cancel so it will be i square root of 3 so here i square root of 3 so also into here we have two solutions which are complex solutions now our conclusion the first value of x is equal to into here this negative 1 which is real solution the second value of x is equal to here negative 5 which is real solution the third value of x is equal to from here when it is positive positive to be negative 2 plus i square root of 3 so negative 2 plus i square root of 3 the fourth value of x is equal to when it is negative to be negative 2 minus i square root of 3 so here negative 2 minus i square root of 3 the fifth value of x is equal to into here when it is positive to be negative 4 plus i square root of 3 so here negative 4 plus i square root of 3 the sixth value of x is equal to negative 4 minus i square root of 3 so here negative 4 minus i square root of 3 so we have four complex solutions and two real solutions total of six solutions because of here we have power of six power of six so we have 60 solutions thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye